Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Keith and welcome to my unboxing of the iPhone 7 Plus. It's very exciting, here it is, all 256 gigabytes of it. So we're gonna about to unbox this bad boy. Now, a lot of times you see these unboxing videos but you don't see the person who's actually doing it. Here I am. Okay, so let's go ahead and get this sucker open. All right, so we've opened it up. We got the box part open, that was pretty simple. So we lift this up and right here it says, designed by Apple in California. That's good to know. And of course in here we open this up and we've got, we've got some stickers and of course we've got the little pin to take out your SIM card. It's very important, you need that. You've gotta get your SIM card out. So let's go ahead and put this back in. Keep this all neat and tidy. I appreciate you checking out my unboxing video, by the way. I'm sure by now you've probably seen a, a gazillion of them. All right, so here we have the iPhone 7 Plus in black. Now, I have right here, I can take it out of its case, the iPhone 7 Plus in gold. Now, I had originally purchased the gold model, but to be perfectly honest with you, after I saw the black model, well, I needed to have it. So here is the black model. Not the jet black, the black. Now before we get to this, I saw, the, I saw the jet black model and yes, it's very sharp looking, but my problem with it was that um, not only the fact that all the fingerprints showed up on it, uh, I just didn't find it as, as attractive as this one. Um, and at the end of the day, any phone that I have is going to go into a case, so I didn't necessarily feel that the jet black would really lend anything to me. So let's go ahead and, and get this off. So I want you to see what I'm talking about here. Okay, so here is the black model. Now, if you look here, so this is very different than the space gray. And you see here that this is such a smooth finish. I wanna show you the difference between the black and the space gray. So this is my this is my 6S Plus, the space gray model. Again, great phone. I'm not going to say anything bad about it. We've had some good times together. But then when you compare it up against the black model, this new black, it's very, very sexy. When you look at these two phones, so you've got here, one of these phones is the 6S, one of these is the 7. So, of course, this is the 6S here, and this is the 7. You might not recognize it looking at the front, but when you look at the back, you know for sure. You've got the single lens versus the double lens. And this is a bit of a problem because any of the cases that I had before, like my BC Lions case, can't work on the new phone because it won't capture the entire camera. Okay, so that's the phone. Let's take a look and see what else we have in the box. So of course we've got our wall adapter, which is very important. You have to make sure that you keep your phone powered. And then we've got the new headphones. So these are not the ear pods. These are, these are just the standard, the standard headphones. Now what's important to note about these is you've got the lightning, you've got the lightning um, connector here. So of course, with the new phone, Apple has done away with the headphone jack. Now this is a bit of an issue for a lot of people because now Apple wants you to go out and spend a certain amount of money on these new AirPods. Quite frankly, I would say if you have some Bluetooth headphones, you might want to go that route as opposed to shelling out 200 plus Canadian for these new AirPods, which really look like earrings. And also in here, as you see, we also have another cable. Uh, this is your, your, your standard lightning uh, power cable here as well, okay? So that is pretty much what you've got in the box with the new iPhone. Um, I'm going to do another quick blog just going through some of the new features and whether or not I think getting the iPhone 7 Plus is worth it. I don't have an iPhone 7 so I can't really review it, but this is the new iPhone 7 Plus. Tell me I couldn't have been a game show host. Alright, thanks so much for checking this out and we'll talk to you soon. Bye.